from the traditional rendang tok dish to pizza for pizza lovers. Use 1 kilo of meat, marinate with the whole packet of rendang tok paste. Refrigerate overnight. To start cooking, heat up some cooking oil. Add in the marinated meat once oil is hot enough. You may add a tablespoon of curry seed. Brown both sides of the meat. Add in 800 ml of water. Cover and let it cook for 15 minutes in medium fire. Once the timer beeps, give it a stir for a while and add in some chopped red and green chilies before letting it cook for another 15 minutes in low fire. When the timer beeps for the second time, turn back to medium fire, stir until gravy thickens. Serve the rendang tok just the way it is. For pizza lovers or those who do not know how to appreciate this traditional dish, get the frozen pizza base, grate about 100 grams of cheese on the pizza base, then add in as much rendang tok meat as you want. This is homemade so put as much meat as you like. Then grate more cheese on it. You may add some red and yellow capsicum sliced into strips to give it some color. Here I use about 200 grams of cheese or pizza topping in total. Fire the pizza in the oven at 235 degrees Celsius for about 10 minutes. When the pizza is done, you will know that rendang tok pairs very well with cheese. If you can't find any pizza base, just use a slice or two of bread. Do the same as how you would do to get your pizza done. Go try them out. Head on to our website to get your rendang tok paste and curry set. Thank you for shopping with Niklo Gome.